Well, howdy y'all. Well, here's a situation unlike most others, I reckon. We are moseying far away from the eastern lands to somewhere a lot more western. Not the west, but a west with an eastern flair, I'd say. This setting's a ghost town in a dust bowl far yonder, a place that I hadn't seen nor heard from the outside world. Every day, this same town, same villagers, same life, maybe for good reason. Not a place to raise a family. Every corner of this town, it's another crime. Robbery, rape, murder, drunken misconduct, all commonplace. And there is one man behind it all. The demon at Hell's Gate. The man said to stand so tall one would mistake him for a lunar eclipse. His name? Ushinosuke Oshamanbe. Pronounced Ushinosuke Chumanbe. Pronounced that way because he told me to do so. And this man? Partner, you do what he says. Ushinosuke Chumanme is what you'd call an East meets West kind of gangster. He slings a six shooter like the best of them, though I hear he rarely uses the thing because he don't need it. On horseback, the man is untouchable, but the man is too good for any mere horse. No, sir. It's said that Ushinosuke wrestled and tamed a wild bull and calls it his trusty steed. They even say that with his bare hands, he ripped its eyeball from its skull, just so the two of they would look alike. You know what? I kind of believe it. And for a big man, he moves quick like a cat. But he adds eastern sensibilities to his fighting style. The man may look like a roughneck, but he's a man of great discipline. Himself the first son of the Oshamande clan and the linchpin of the Oshimande School of Western Martial Arts. His chosen instrument of destruction is his chain, his control of that thing. It's inhuman. Bad gods control that chain. In his holsters, he carries twin throwing hatchets made for wholesale blade-on-flesh slaughter. It's said that he's quite the crack shot with them things. His axes are even deadlier weapons than pistols, I'd say. This man has a hold on this here town. He casts a shadow on this place like a dang Bermuda's triangle. No one who comes into this town would live to come out. You can imagine what that's done to the tourist trade. He and his posse, a pack of slobbering hyenas who turned their backs on the good lord some moons ago. They run roughshod over this place like a cancer. Their horses are ones of motorized steel. Skilled poachers in their own right, they're excellent in stealing livestock but also partake in any criminal fringe benefit they can get their claws on. The devil Ushinosuke walks into the local watering hole and he parts the room. He takes what he wants, when he wants. Dang shame. It wasn't always this way. No, sir. No, there used to be a law in this here town. A law by the name of Joe. Man was a regular martial brave star. Made them cowboys from Moon Mesa look like a bunch of steers. Could play a six string guitar, too, just like them riders in the sky. No, sir, when he was around, this land was one of prosperity and commerce. The Ushinosukes of the world stayed in their holes and played nice. Let the rest of us breathe a little. But the man disappeared mysteriously one day. Who knows, maybe Ushinosuke got him. Or maybe another town needed him more. I'll tell you what, we sure could use another Joe. But the chances of that are slim. Only new folk we see around here are wayward souls, nomads with no purpose. And this fella I've seen round town recently, dressed in yellow with black stripes, already acting like the big dog in the yard. A brazen young cowpoke, not afraid to mix it up with the scum of this town. He's a lot smaller than Joe, but the kid, he's got spunk. Last I heard, he stood up to Ushinosuke on more than one occasion and the two fought to a stalemate. At least that's what I heard down at the old watering hole. I, for one, 
<laughs> Hope that all these wives' tales are true. You may not be able to play the guitar, but this town, it needs something. And maybe, just maybe, this Hibiki kid. Hey, I kinda like that. The Hibiki kid can be the new sheriff of this here town to bring a little bit of law to the doorstep of lawless scum like Ushinosuke Chumande. This has been a run one half. Kids! Character profile!